Welcome to Siena College, proud home of the Siena Saints. Our student body consists of over 350 student athletes, and our athletic facilities just underwent $13.5 million worth of improvements. Come on, let's go take a look. Here we are in the brand new Siena Saints varsity weight room. This spread out area has all the accommodations to make us better athletes. Two great advantages of this new weight room is that it's exclusive to student athletes and the one-on-one -on -one attention we get from our two full-time strength and conditioning coaches. Now we'll pass it off to our head strength and conditioning coach, Ernie Rook. So the weight room includes squat racks, platforms, conditioning equipment. We're lucky enough to have indoor turf where we can push sleds and do different activities all year round. The other great thing about Siena is we have two full-time staff members here at all times. So that allows us to write individual programs for not only the individual teams, but the individual athletes as well. So we really strive to not only make the workout sport specific, but also try to help out our individual athletes as much as we can. We're here now in the brand new George and Sally Maloney Sports Medicine Suite. New accommodations include eight new rehabilitation tables, both a hot and cold hydrotherapy pools, my personal favorite, an underwater treadmill, your classic ice and electrical stimulation, as well as a new pro plate, and they're always accessible to the athletes. The best touch is the trainers themselves. They're highly dedicated to treating every student athlete, and everyone has a great relationship with them because of the time and dedication they put in to making sure we're healthy, safe, and ready to go back on the field. Student athletes do not only have a strong relationship with the trainers, they also work hand in hand with the team physician and Albany Medical Network, which is top notch. Anytime you have a serious injury and need to be sent off the premise, that is the place to go and it's always available. It's a beautiful day here on Hickey Field. The turf is brand new and this is a field for champions, home to men's soccer, men's lacrosse, women's lacrosse, and the student body intramural program. Hickey Field seats over a thousand fans in these stands. And trust me, we fill it to the brim. There's a brand new press box and a tailgating area for get-togethers and cookouts before each game. Here we are at Connors Park, home of Siena Baseball. This wonderful facility just underwent half a million dollars of improvements. It's one of the finest college baseball parks in the Northeast. Some highlights of the improvements include a fully turfed backstop, enhanced and enlarged dugouts with heaters, during cold winter months, these stay warm. New chair backs and bleacher seatings, a press box with filming platforms, safety netting, storage, and a new irrigation system. When you come and play baseball here at Siena, you are playing under Coach Rossi, the legend. He's been the head coach at Siena for over 50 years, the longest tenured head coach in NCAA history. This is the renowned women's soccer field. It is exclusive to varsity women's soccer only, and it's one of the final fully functional grass fields in the MAC conference. This gives our ladies a distinct home field advantage. The women's soccer field recently installed a brand new press box, as well as weatherproof benches for both the home and away teams. This is the varsity softball field. In the corner tucked away on campus, but a cornerstone of the athletic development here at Santa College. This field features newly refurbished backstops, fencing, and dugouts, as well as indoor and outdoor batting cages so the Saints can stay sharp all year round. As we conclude the tour, we take a look at the half a million dollar Frank and Sheila Ambrose Media Center. Our student body produces content for Siena State sporting events that's featured on the great ESPN. I hope you enjoyed the tour, and of course, march on.